Welcome everybody. Hello. Hi everyone. Welcome, Welcome to back. Story Time with Sarah and Nathan and Pastor Trudy. Today we're going to be sharing a wonderful story with you and it is called Put Me in the Zoo by Robert Lopshire. But before we begin, we will start as usual with a word of prayer and we're going to invite Sarah to get us started. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for this day. And thank you that we're doing another live stream and that everybody who watches will be blessed. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. 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 All right, I hope you guys are having a great day today. And we're going to have a wonderful story time. And Nathan is going to read first, Put Me in the Zoo by Robert Lobshire. Lobshire. Polka dots. Polka dots. Polka dots. I remember Polka dot. last week you read the, the other book. I will go into the zoo. I want to see it. Yes, I do. Who's going into the zoo, Nate? Tell us what, about it. The What's... dog we saw in the last book. What was the last book called? Oh, uh, I want to be somebody new. Yeah. I want to be somebody new. Yeah. So this is his backstory. I would like to live this way. This is where I want to stay. Yep. Why do you think he wants to live there? What do you notice on this picture? What are the animals getting? Like, Lion food. Cold, I can't hear you. Cold. They're getting like combed and groomed. Look at the seal. So, oh, the sea he's lion. getting treats. Yeah, he's getting treats. So many fishes. Just all the food you could eat. Get your hair done, your nails yeah. done. Oh yeah, that's, I would like to live like this the way. Nathan? Will you keep me in the zoo? I want to stay here with you. Oh, will you please keep me in the zoo? I want to stay in here with you. I think that's what he sounds like. Yeah. We do not want you in the zoo. Out you go. Out. Out with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're being mean to him. That's it. Look at him dragging his little feet. He's like, <laughs> he's, like, he's don't. going boneless. Yeah. <laughs> Why did they put me out this way? I should be in. I want to stay. Hmm. Is he happy or mad? Mad! Yeah. Very, really very, mad. very mad. Why should I put you in the zoo? What good are you? What can you do? Yeah, what good are you, dude? Yeah. Hello. You're, you're a weird yellow dot, a dog with red spots on him. He's he a chicken pox. dog with kangaroo feet. <laughs> yes. I mean, and the yeah. kangaroo tail. But what can he do? What he? good am I? What what can I do? Now here is one thing I can do. Look, now all his spots are blue. blue. One of my favorite clues. Yes. My favorite goes blue. And now his spots are orange. Say, he looks so good that way. Oh yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Look at him. He looks like he just came from the Bahamas. Yeah, like yes. he's got a major tan. Now look at this. What do you see? Green spots, as green as green can be. Oh, Those yeah. Those one of my favorite colors. Oh, that's two favorite colors for Nathan. This one. Violet spots. Say, you are good. Do, do more, do more. We wish you we wish you would. Oh, yeah. What? yeah. That's one of my favorite what? colors, too. What's whole favorite color? Yeah. It is my favorite color. The pretty purple. I can do more. Look, this is new. Whoa. Blue, orange, green, and violet, too. And white. And One white one. No, there isn't. No, there's That's oh, his, there's no white this one. air. What's air? Oh, they would put me in the zoo if they could see what I can do. I know. Fail. It isn't fair. I can put my spots on this ball, and I can put them on the wall. Awesome. So cool. Would you go to the zoo to see him? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I can put them on a cat. I can put them on a hat. We rhyme. Yes, they do. These are rhyming words. Good noticing that. Look at the cat. Does he look happy? No. He looks very mad. What like he in the beginning. I know. What sound do you think that cat's making right now? <laughs> uh, I can put them on the zoo. I can put my spots on you. Yep. Awesome. I don't think little, I don't think little models would like that. Yeah, I don't think so. Look at this now. One, two, three. I can put them on a tree. tree. 
My favorite type of plant. A tree, yes. If you notice the little girl, she's trying to clean the spots off and she can't get them off. No, because it's his spots. Mm -hmm. He has to control. Yeah, and he does. And now, when I say one, two, three, all my spots are back on me. Bring! Is that the sound that would make? No, no. it would just be like... <laughs> okay, I like that. That will be the sound to get his spots back. Look now, here is one thing more. I take my spots, I make them four. Oh, they would put me in the zoo if they could see what I can do. And take my, I take? I take my spots. I take them all. I, I can take one. I can make one very small. Look how tiny. Okay, now, does he have any spots left on him? No. No. Could that he, looks normal. -ish. Could he still be called Spot, though? No. No. I don't know. And now, you see, I take them all, and I can make them very tall. Tall! Tall. Well, next, next he's going to make them... What? You didn't know that. Go I ahead. was going to say fat. fat. Okay, sure. Read it. And when I want to have more fun, I take my spots and make them one. One giant spot. Yeah. Or one fat spot, as Nathan says. What do you want to say? Also, if you notice the color that I drew on here when I was much younger, well, it was me. When I was much younger. If you if you look at the page, how many how many technical spots are on the page? One, two spots. <laughs> yes, they should put me in the zoo. The things I can do. The things my spots and I can do. <laughs> oh, he's so cool. Spot box. Yes. Spot See, box. I can put them in a box. In the spot box we go. Ooh, yes. How did he make them flat? Where did he get the box from? <laughs> and I take them out. Look at. They look, look like. They look like socks. Yay, socks. Christmas stockings. I want some socks. That glow. I have a lot of socks. I lost most of them. Me too. <laughs> Tara? And I can put them way up high. Up, up they go. I can make them fly. Spots don't fly. No. His spots do. Fly. They fly like this. Like that. Do you notice the color in there? Do you know why it's all dotted, Nate? Do you remember? What were we trying to do? Oh, I think we we'll Oh, yeah. We were, no, we were trying to count all the dots. Did oh, we ever finish counting no, all the dots? We no. We never counted all. It was too hard. So, parents, if you feel like giving your kids a 10-minute break, pause the video when you we replay and have them attempt to count all those yeah. dots. Yeah. It'll How about this page? Count. I put them high up in the air. My spots fly here. My spots fly there. Well, everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. That should be a song. It should totally be a song. I call them back now. One, two, three. Now, all my spots are back with me. Tell me, tell me now. You two, do you like the things I do? Hmm. He Who called them you back. There? You like him? Yeah. What was the sound of the spots coming back to him? <laughs> I like that sound. <laughs> tell me, tell me now, you two. Will they put me in the zoo? Well, <sighs> they look like salami. <laughs> they do look, look like salami. We like all the things you do. We like your spots. We like you too. Yay! Yay. Yay. So they're going to so put him in the zoo. Probably. Put him in the zoo. Yeah. Well, we Yay. should, but... What? He needs a noble backstory. Oh, yeah, probably. But you should not be in the zoo. You should not be in the zoo. Oh, wait. But, but... I, I thought no. this was a happy book. This is a sad book this now. This is a sad book. Sarah? And all the things that you can do. The circus is the place for you. Huh? It, it is a happy book. It is a happy book. They found the place for him. Now the circus is the place for you. Yes. Uh, this 
focuses. What is where I want to be? Well, focus is a good place for me. All right, he found oh, a place where he wanted to be. That the circus is the place for him. This hey, is where he okay. wants to be. Shh. 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 Don't, don't tell them. Okay, Nathan spotted a surprise in yeah, this picture. Yeah. It. If you look closely, you can see a special somebody yeah. right yeah. where I just pointed to. Yep. The cat in the hat is in that picture, and it's really cool. And the story he ends with, door. and there's a door, he and lots have of spots, spots that we never tried to count. This is where I want to be. The circus is the place for me. So did he end up at the zoo? No. 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 That was not the place for him. Wait. And then, in a, in a new yellow book, he's in a zoo. No, he's part of the circus. Yeah. You said. He wanted to be somebody new, yeah. like oh, an yeah. elephant and a giraffe. Now, let's see. What do we learn in this story? Uh, I don't know. You didn't learn anything? No. <laughs> Nothing at all? No. Can you think? Now, I have a Bible verse. Can you think of anything from the Bible that you might put with this story? No, because I have no word for Bible. Too much. <laughs> uh, no. Nope, nothing no. from the Bible. Well, he wanted to be in the zoo. He thought that's where he belonged. He felt like he should definitely go. This is where he belongs. He can go in the zoo and everyone could come and look at him. But in the end, he ended up at the circus because that's the place that was for him. The Bible tells us in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 29 and verse 14, the Bible says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper, to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and future. Amen. Well, we have, um, the Bible telling us that God has a plan for you. So whatever you have to do in life, the point of the story is put it in God's hands. That's what I'm going to say. Because you might want to go to the zoo, but maybe you belong at the circus. Yeah? No? That's not the point? What? Okay. No! Maybe your plan is to be a aircraft engineer, but God said, hey, maybe you're really, really great. He gave you a talent for um, being a teacher or being an um, astronaut, astronaut, doctor. You have to follow God's plan. He has good plans for you, and he wants to see them accomplished in your life. And when you follow God's plan, you will end up where you actually belong and where you will be your best. When the dog Spot got to the circus, he could use his talent to make an awesome show. And when you're following God, he's going to make sure your talent gets used the right way. What's your talent? Uh, huh. Acting. 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 Yes, you love acting. Sarah, what's your talent? Maybe playing piano and making little thingies. Making little thingies, which <laughs> I will post on Facebook for you to see. She has been making awesome little teeny tiny crafts, and they're Don't really beautiful. What? Don't forget to post it. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to yeah, forget to post it. It'll never be there. I'm sorry. Um, all right. Thank you guys for watching. I see a question from um, Jossie. I remember Jossie. Everybody say hi to Jossie. Hi, Jossie. Hello, Jossie. <laughs> she was our neighbor. And this is Sarah. Sarah, say hi. Hello. Hi. And you, the, this one is Nathan. Nathan is, how old are you now? Seven. Seven know. years we old. We, so we he is just guy. seven years old. And Jesse's not in this video. He thinks he's too grown for it. Yes. I see Sister Karen watching. Hi, Sister Karen. We miss you too. Hi. We miss you. Uh, glad to see everyone watching. We appreciate this. And we hope that you like and share and follow. We are doing this on Thursdays to keep it fun. Thursdays at 4 p.m. I hope I see you back here next week, Thursday, 4 p.m. Have a great day, everybody. Wait, Bye. we forgot to pray. We did. It was you. Oh, he didn't want to. Lord, we thank you for today. Thank you for our friends, our family. We thank you for all your goodness and your mercy and for having a plan for us. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Now we can say goodbye. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. See ya. <laughs> Bye, everyone.